pictures tarnishing the image of a developing India make our society feel ashamed. These pictures of 70 years after independence still point towards a very big problem of our country. Under the Swachh Bharat mission, the objective of making house-to-house -to -house toilets at a cost of crores of rupees is a step to get rid of this problem. But after all, why even today in our rural environment and backward areas, these pictures come in front of us from time to time? Yes, on one hand, we are becoming modern and on the other, we are still forced to face shameful reality like open defecation. Statistics show that the rate of open defecation in India alone is 60% of the world. According to the Ministry of Urban Development, 51% of the households in unauthorized colonies and slums do not have toilets, due to which the practice of open defecation continues even today. Regrettably, people consider it neither wrong nor harmful. Still, more than 50% of India's population does not know how adverse effects can be on their health due to open defecation and it can spread many diseases. Do you know only 1 gram of human feces has 1 crore viruses, 10 lakh bacteria, 1000 parasites and 100 parasite eggs? These can pose a danger to you and your family. They can pose a danger to you and your family. Statistics show that about 700 million people in India either defecate in the open or use dry latrines. The number of these dry latrines in India is about 7.64 lakh, of which about 5.4 lakh are in the cities and the rest 2.24 lakh are in rural areas. These dry toilets pose a health hazard to the entire community and also contaminate the environment. Studies show that more than 50 infectious diseases are transmitted through human excreta. And it is also true that every year millions of people lose their lives due to infection in our country. Now you can imagine how open defecations is like inviting diseases. To keep life clean and prevent diseases, it is very important to stop open defecation. Let us know how open defecation affects the health of human life. Disadvantages of open defecation This increases the risk of infection in water resources, promotes water, land and air pollution, increased risk of infectious diseases in humans, has a profound effect on children's health, security and privacy threats to women, inconvenient for elderly and sick people. You have seen the profound impact of open defecation on human health. Not only this, Doing so also causes a lot of damage to our environment. With the habit of open defecation, we are contaminating our water, forest and land. In such a situation, the government has taken several steps to ban open defecation under the Swachh Bharat mission. Construction of free toilets in the homes of economically weaker people in the villages. Facility of government grant to people in rural areas to build toilets, modern toilets in villages and backward areas based on government standards, awareness campaign through advertisements about the construction and use of toilets. Through this scheme, the government aims to improve the standard of living of the people living in rural areas as well as promote substantial sanitation in rural areas. But the biggest difficulty for the government in this mission is that only by making toilets or by educating and motivating people to use it, we cannot fulfill the objective of Swachh Bharat mission. Because the purpose of this campaign is also to properly manage human excreta, so that sewage and urine cannot contaminate the groundwater. These sewage cannot reach the water sources through pipes from the pit and this waste cannot contaminate the environment through open air. So its management and disposal is very important. Gandhiji had said that the waste, if it reaches its proper place, can also be of benefit to us. With these few words, Gandhiji gave a great message to the people. Therefore, the central government also started the Swachh Bharat mission in the year 2014 by making the glasses of Gandhiji a model. Through this campaign, Emphasis has been laid on the management of all types of garbage and waste, whether it is household waste or animal and human waste. 
Today, the government is emphasizing on efficient management of all types of waste and is also helping people for this. It is a fact that human waste can only be disposed of through toilets, while through its proper management, we can also use it for energy generation and organic manure. That is, farming can also be benefited with sewage and it is also of great help for the environment. It has also been proven by scientific tests that better sanitation facilities not only improve the health of the people but also improve their economic and social development. So let us also take a pledge that we will put an end to open defecation and make our water, forest and land clean.